nice bacon. And dapat may eggs. <laughs> Pero okay na po. Let's make avocado smoothie. Yan, simple lang po. Walang kuryente na kailangan. Ito po yung aking gamit. Maliit lang siya. Parang bowl lang. Tapos ilalagay mo lang yan sa loob. Tatakpan mo. Okay, early on, naipakita ko na po how to use that <laughs> during the pandemic po. So, anyway, buhay na buhay pa po siya at gagamitin po natin today. Okay, so in making our avocado smoothie, so we have two slices of avocado, uh, which means that's one whole. Two slices of avocado, which means that's one whole. Yes, only for one glass or one bowl like that. So we're going to put milk, powdered milk and sugar and of course water before you okay, blend it. Yes, you can cut it that way. Of course, it's a very soft. Yes, because it's uh, already ripe. And so, this is what we're going to do. We're going to turn them into cubes, right? So, if you can help it, don't choose the same chopping board as your vegetables. Especially not with the chopping board that's used for onions and garlics, right? So, even if you wash them sometimes, the residue remains. Especially if it's plastic like this. So, it would be much better to use a wooden one. Oh, sorry about that. So, natanggal. So, okay. So, hugasan po natin. Okay. Hinugasan. And ito na po. So, we're going to put all those inside this one. Okay. So, lalagay po natin lahat ng yan dito sa ating... Okay, anong tawag mo dyan? Hand. <laughs> okay, hand mixer. It's not a uh, electric mixer, but it's only a hand mixer. I'll show you in a while. Yan na po, lalagyan na natin ng sugar and milk. Yes, and a little water. Oh, sa na po yung cold water, inilagay na po natin. Lagyan na natin siya ng milk, powdered milk. If you have condensed milk, pwede rin po yan or evaporated milk, it's up to you. So, konting sugar and depends upon your sugar level. Of course, we have to close. Okay. To keep our canisters good. And we're going to cover cover this one. It's like this. So, ipashoot nyo lang po dyan. <laughs> Wait. And then, you're going to pull it. Wait lang. It's so simple. It's like that. Okay. So, almost done. And then, you're going to pull this na lang. Okay. okay that's your avocado smoothie. Maganda sana kung merong mint, no? Lalagyan natin ng something green. <laughs> But it's okay. So, simply lang. Yan na po ang ating avocado smoothie for a lot more vitamin E. For good skin. Uh, what else? O, o good complexion and even nice hair. Shiny hair. Avocado smoothie. Meron na po tayong fried fish at isisigang po natin. So, para mabilis, lemon na lang po. Lemon juice na lang ang aking gagawin na pang-asim. Sinigang sa lemon. Ayan po yung kangkong. And ready na yung ating sibuyas, kamatis, at saka okra. At uh, sige lang, kahit walang talong. <laughs> at eto na lang po. Pero kung meron kayo, mas maganda yung meron ganun. So, ayan ang siling haba. At ayan na, ready na tayo for the sigang. So, I boil the water. Ayan, ayan. Nag-boil na po tayo ng water. At tayo po ay maglalagay na ng kamatis at sibuyas. Ayan, hinalo-halo na po natin lahat. Let's boil all the vegetables except the dahon, except the leaves of our kangkong. So, the tomatoes, the onions, 
uh, what else? Okra. And of course, the stems of our kangkong are already there. And plus the ceiling haba, which is pepper, green pepper. Yes, so merong pepper na, uh, which we cut, sliced, but uh, we have also one hole, like this one. So, so that for those who would like to, to take more spicy, <laughs> to take the soup uh, spicier, so that's it. It's for them. <laughs> Okay, mahihilig sa spicy. But for those who'd like only mild spiciness, yon, Yung siling haba na ating, uh, which we sliced. <laughs> the green peppers which we sliced, those are for uh, milder spiciness. Okay, when that boils again, we're going to put in our fish. That's it. So, that's the pan I use, the frying pan for the fish. But uh, the fish are already done. Well, that's the fish. We will get about two pieces, two slices of the fish for our sinigang na isda. And finally, when everything's uh, almost done, ito na po yung ating, yes, leaves, kangkong leaves for the final touch. And of course, your seasoning to taste. <laughs> Yan po. So when it's boiling like that, you may... Yes, put in your fish and finally your kang kong leaves. Ito na po yung fish. Okay, since it's already fried, so no problem. Oo, konting ano na lang po yan at uh, we're done. Ayan, ayan. So, lagay na po natin. Ito. Okay, dalawa lang po. Just two. And para may sabaw lang siya. And of course, para hindi madurog, hindi na po madudurog yan. Kasi, okay, naka-fry na siya. Let's, uh, yes, our Hong Kong leaves. There you go. Our Hong Kong leaves are in. Yes, and uh, of course, yung lemon juice. Okay, para maasim. <laughs> maasim po talaga ang tinatawag nating yes, sinigang na isda. Ayan, lagay na po natin yung ating pampaasim sa sinigang. Ayun na po. Yung ating lemon juice. Dagdagan pa natin yan ng isa pang sangkap. And of course, salt. Yes, as your seasoning. Lagyan mo pa ng pepper, okay lang po. Ito po yung final na pang asim ko, sinigang, sa sampalok. Ayan na po. So, for a final, yes, sopas ng sinigang. So, sinigang na isda sa sampalok. Pero nilagyan ko ng lemon. <laughs> okay, simply Jane, sinigang na isda sa sampalok. <laughs>